good evening wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. Uh, it's been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. Blue and burgundy wherever you look, hymns ringing loud and proud. This is what it is to be in the Camp Du. Barcelona have been in fine fettle of late, which can only add further to an already eagerly awaited encounter. Well, this is the team you'd prefer to avoid, Peter, but it can be approached with a different psychological stance, meaning their run has to come to an end, so why not here? things on the way. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Yeah, Jordi Alba. He's got such searing pace, Peter. He gets to the byline in the blink of an eye. And from there, his crosses are, are pinpoint and very hard to defend against. This opposition defence is going to have its work cut out, trying to keep him quiet. <laughs> I wonder whether that has anything to do with you being a yeah, they found themselves tend in, nowhere to go. Casemiro completes a free kick for that. It's not taking him long, and that's going to be a booking. I'll tell you what, there's been a lot of inflammatory talk leading up to this there, so often is, and it just me. stokes it further, doesn't it? Yeah, that's certainly... He's gone for goal! Well positioned to make that interception. Kane, now it's Kane. Big chance! Barcelona are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter attacking heaven. Barcelona take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. Well, that goal has got the whole stadium rocking here. This is exactly the kind of atmosphere the players should feed off now. Mbappe. He's had that put on a plate. And he's going for goal. It's there. And already they're looking to run away with it. The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. Well, none of us were exactly sure how that was going to end up then, but I'm delighted to see such a happy ending after such a splendid dribbling run. I mean, he really did pull that defence into wondering what he was going to do next. Barcelona have a couple of goals without reply. It's 2-0. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. But he deserted them when they really needed it. Benzema has a gone and it was. And it's Sergio Ramos. And he's has a pop! Oh, it's gone in! Back to within one! Interesting! 
Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. And they really commit forward. Not readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Now can he? He's gone for it! Dispatched clinically! They have done it! They have their equaliser! Speed of thought, efficiency of movement and certainty of outcome. Well, it's pretty damning on the part of that defence, Peter, that he was allowed so much time and space. But I think you have to give credit where it's due. And it was a brilliant setup and finish. We have ourselves a real... Now the counter. Chance, there's a goal! Oh, that is asking for trouble. Turns and goes back. Looking for goal! And we reached half time. It has been a pretty crazy game so far. He played out in extraordinary fashion and the scoreline underlines that. And we are up to the break. We've seen some really terrific football in that half with the flow of goals. And of course... Balls out on the left now. He's got the ball, he's got the space! loose who's getting there Hazard striding forward face it goes for goal and the finish goal well that's what the top players do the ability to seize the initiative at crucial times in the game and now this second half has a completely different outlook that's no fluke it's what he was there for Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. And it is a great credit. Mbappe drives it forward. Gets the better of his man. And the shot! Griezmann is short. And it's Roberto. Shapes the shoot! And he's there to make it. Now it's Kane. Tries to dink it in. Now it's Griezmann. It's Griezmann! I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. Now it's Kane, Roberto, he's got away, Roberto! He really, the striker should be the first line of that defence and, and he's delivering. And hits one! Should have equalised, that was extreme. Vinicius Junior, now it's Hazard. And they've been caught out here. Vin Hazard hits! What a wonderful stop! Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. He's through the middle. Could be thinking, he's had a go! Sticks it away! And this is getting better and better. The understanding between those two plays a big part in that and releasing the run on side proved the key ingredient. When the manager called on him, he was only too happy to repay that fate. That's how you make an impact as a sub. You know, when most are tiring, you can impose a freshness and energy to best effect on an introduction. Madrid could not have picked a better time to snatch a two-goal lead. Is there still time for a response? Now some fans are already on their way out. 
So that to me says everything, Peter. Sports officials showing that there will be three minutes of added time. That's great strength on the ball. And TT. A really good feat from him. So that's it. It is all over. What a match. What a comeback. That is how to respond to adversity. Truly deserving winners. The end of the game. Reflections. Madrid made their intentions clear that nothing else but a win would do. These games are always tough. You know, it's, it's not always about form. It's not always about class.